so you're talking about uploading consistently. So what does that kind of look like exactly? Do you upload like every day? Do you have a certain number that you're looking for to get up a week? So for the last almost just over four years, I've uploaded a new beat every Monday and Thursday without fail. That's amazing. <laughs> Literally every Monday and Thursday, a beat is gone on, you know, B stars, YouTube and everything. Two mm. beats Monday and Thursday for the last four years. And I know um, I, I know on YouTube that you like, stay consistent because of that. So it just goes to show. Right. And it helps in multiple ways too. Like I know that on YouTube, it helps the algorithm, right? Like if you're uploading consistently that I, mm. I, I think they say that, that if that it factors into it um, yeah, like, uh, as well, because I'm um, like your fans will know when you release stuff. So yeah. they'll be constantly checking, at, you know, that exact time on those days. Yeah. Do you fit, do you see like that in your in your analytics at all? Like people are are, are watching um, or listening right away when you upload because because they know when you're posting. Yeah. yeah, I think I do. I do like. So in like 24 hours, I do about 1500 views on a new beat. But in the first hour, I do about 500. Mm. So it just shows like they're right there and then, you know, but right. I don't, I'm not sure. YouTube's another like. Who knows what he's doing? Like, yeah, who knows? I, th I think it's changing all the time too. It so it's like, it's hard to like, I mean, you can study it, but it's hard like to keep up with it all the time because it changes and no, they don't tell anybody. Yeah, no, it's just like, like yeah. they know like the AI that controls it, they have, it's doing its own thing now. That's just, right. like, they don't know what's going on. It's too powerful. It's, it's, out, of, it's, it's out of their powerful. hands now. Lord knows. Right. Um, and so, what kind of happens uh, like within that process, right? So you so you upload every Monday and Thursday. Do you have like a consistent schedule where you where you work on it? Do you have like benchmarks that you kind of commit yourself to hitting throughout the week to make sure that you you get those uploads up? Yeah. So like um, like beginning of the week is when I wanna I kind of like write the beats in advance, mm -hmm. like a week in advance. But obviously you can't like force creativity. So like it happens when it happens. But towards okay. the start of the week. I try to get some beats written and then towards the end of the week, I start picking which of those beats are going to be the two I release next week. And then I do pick them and then do the artwork and schedule them and that sort of stuff. Like I don't like to, I've done it before where I haven't had a beat until like the night before. And then you're kind of rushing and it goes back to that whole frame of mind thing. And now you're stressing and you're just putting anything out. Right. I have it in advance so that there's no stress and you just, you have all the time to make music. Yeah, I agree. I think for especially creatives, like it's kind of like you have to find a middle ground, right? Like structure is really key. Otherwise, like with creative types, like I know I'm I'm one too. Like you might just be like, you know what? I don't feel like it this week. So then like you'll forget about it. But then you also don't want to get into that position where you're rushing yourself and putting out something that's not up to your standards exactly. just to get it up. So really having a schedule and planning things out ahead of time to make sure you're not rushing is as really as where... You're giving yourself enough time to write, right? Write music, like like you said, like you can't just write a hit instantly or anything. You can't just you can't say now go and write an amazing beat, and I'll probably be like, I'll write something awful. <laughs> right, exactly. It's just giving yourself time to let the creativity and the inspiration hit, because that right. can come whenever. It's coming like five a.m. before for me, and then I've been up all night. <laughs> right. And it happens for everybody on their own time too, you know, like yeah, some yeah. people kind of go through things and they just like to work super quickly. Like I know some people might get caught up like in the YouTube tutorials where like, they, where like they make the beat in like 10 minutes and it sounds great, but like, but you know, like you don't see like all the cuts that go in between that. Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah. 